Hi, and welcome to my channel. My name is Diana, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to diagnose and fix a power issue on an iPhone. We have here a customer phone. It's an iPhone 8 Plus, which has no power, no charging, is not doing anything. So first of all, we need to check to to see what's happening. I have my power meter here. All right, let me zoom it a little bit. All right. So when you plug the charger, it's taking like a few milliamps. Usually an iPhone is taking over one amp, around two amps, something like that. But in this case, as you can see, it's taking just a few milliamps. Right, so can be, can be the charging port, can be the motherboard, or can be the battery. For this one, we need to open up and let's see what is inside. Right, first of all, we're gonna unscrew those two screws on the, on the bottom, as you can see. All right, screws are out. Then gently, we're gonna heat up the, um, the screen because it has some um, glue on the side. And because, uh, let me see how to focus this one, because, all right. As you can see, the screen has a little crack here at the bottom, so we need to be careful when we lift the screen. All right. Gently heat up the screen. All right, let's see. Just carefully in that corner. Screen is open. All right, looks like this phone was fixed before because it has a, as you can see, has a seal here. Well, let's see what All right, let's see the, let's check this battery first. As you can see, we have the multimeters on the, on the screen. So we're gonna quickly check the battery. Has no power, it's zero. So I'm gonna, Charge a little bit battery with um, with a power supply. You can you cannot see it, but we're gonna charge it. Yeah. It's taking current 1.82, so which is good.
All right, I'm gonna charge a little bit. Right, let's All right, let's see now. After we charge the battery. Has 3.2. Are they good? That's mean we have power in our battery. All right, let's check to see if he's charging. Nope. Right, now let's check with uh, another charging port. Have up here a brand new charging port. All right, let's see if I can plug this right here. Right. It looks like it's a charging port issue. 2.3 amps. Right. So we found we found the problem. Now, we need to unscrew all this, take the old charging port, put a new one, and that's it. All right, let's do it. Right, so we have the battery on the screen. Now it's, it's showing it's charging. As you can see, it takes 2.3 amps. All right. And there you go, it's on. <laughs> Problem solved. We had the charging sign in the in the corner. Everything works perfectly. Right. And I put the screen back. Again, very slowly because it has a, this crack on the side. There you go.
put the two screws at the bottom. All right. So, all right, let me zoom it a little bit more. So actually, as you can see on my power meter, right? Now it takes 2.2 amps. That's mean it's very good. So in this case, a power meter can be so useful for those kind of problems with the power because you can see how much current, how much power goes inside the phone, right? Good. All right, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you like the video and see you in the next one. Bye.